And this year, the Inside Sort readers have voted the best soap as Emmerdale. <laughs> unbelievably proud to win this and we want to thank all of the viewers but we're really grateful to everybody that voted so thank you and the couple the public love it's the late Mal Pollard and Eric I'd just like to thank I'd like to thank Chris for being my best husband the best husband I've ever had for the last 10 years and um, all my comrades who are here tonight and the award goes to Victoria falls through the ice. Thank you so much. Uh, this is brilliant. There's just a few thank yous to uh, Anita, to Tim, and to Keith who invested so much into the storyline and let me direct it, which is brilliant. Um, to all these guys who are fantastic, especially to Izzy and to Luke, who spent literally hours underwater in the freezing cold. We make six episodes a week, and when we can do that, come on! <laughs> and the winner is Emmerdale for Cameron's. Uh, it's wicked for me to leave the show at a point where I'm leaving it at the best it's ever been. Sexiest meal, best bad boy, and best actor, Mr. Michael Parks. Thank you to everyone who voted. Uh, thank you to everyone who was nominated. Thank you to the cast and crew. And the winner is. In the uh, our show, we feel like it's been on a real roll for quite a while now. So to the people who voted for us, thank you so much. Don't underestimate what that means to us. The winner is... The Live 40th Anniversary! <laughs> I'd just like to say that this was a, a, a big team effort and we've got such a fantastic crew and without all the crew and everybody from the press office, the writers, Paul Roundell, Tony Prescott, we love you Tony Prescott, he's Woo! absolutely amazing. <laughs> Stuart Blackburn, thank you sir, we owe you. Um, just what an amazing night it was for us all and the first ever live outside broadcast and uh, I don't think there were many mistakes so it was good, thank you very much. And the winner is John Amoyo's car accident. Emma. I'd just like to say uh, a big thank you to Andy Sugden for letting us use his Land Rover. <laughs> and uh, I'll, I'll pass over to the brilliant director, Mike Layson. I just want to say a massive thank you to the crew. We worked so, so hard. Um, without them, we wouldn't be stood here. And um, the cast, I mean, Natalie and James, absolutely fantastic. And all the cast, really, because you know what? They genuinely move people uh, through the performances, and that's a pleasure to be around. So, thank you. Thank you. But the winner is... Jackson's Choice, Amadeus. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. I mean, I know these, these sentiments have been echoed before, but I would like to thank Gavin Blythe, because if it wasn't for him and everyone at Emmerdale, then I wouldn't be part of this and we wouldn't have this. I also want to thank my missus for putting up with me and also dedicate this to my dad as well. It's not been a great year for us, so this should be going to him. Oh, and Danny Miller as well. I'd throw Danny in the next time. He's done some of that performances, but yeah, I really, it means a lot. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. Amelia Flanagan! Thank you. I'd like to say thank you to everyone at Emmerdale, all my family and all my friends, everyone from Emmerdale and the panel who voted. Thank you. Goodbye. Thank you so much. That was um, a treat of a
beautiful monologue written by Caroline Mitchell. It was about three minutes long and it was just gorgeous to play, so thank you. Um, thank you to the Emdale family for welcoming me back, especially Kate Oates. Kate, you're amazing, such a support, thank you. A really special thank you to my Emmerdale family and the amazing Mike Parr, Mark Charnock, Tony Audenshaw, and my on-screen daughter, Amelia Flanagan. If I may, uh, I would just personally like to dedicate this award to Anne Kirkbride, who I've had the pleasure of being in a class with. Oh, work really hard, especially you know, we spend days and days in that. We spend days and days in this bloody filthy, filthy water. You know. I, I tried to have something prepared, but you know, it's cool, isn't it? The winner is Eden Taylor Jr. <laughs> <laughs> for Emma Dale. Ready, sit on there, sit back, sit back, that's it, there you go. Thank you very much. I'd just like to say thank you to my mum, she's been helping me so much, and my dad and everyone at Emmerdale. Thank you. The winner of the Best Young Performance is... Eden Taylor Draper. I can't believe this. I'm copy for just met you too. That's like the best thing ever. Um, thank you so much. It means so much. And thank you, Emmerdale, for being amazing. And Dingles, awesome. Um, thank you, and Rethington. The winner is Danny Miller. Well, thank you very much for that. It's much appreciated. Um, you never really know what to say to these kind of things, but I think um, one thing I want to say in particular is that um, there's a man who I want to dedicate this award to um, completely, uh, who unfortunately can't be with us tonight. Um, it's Gavin Blythe. He was um, unbelievable. Yeah. He was an unbelievable man that was... Um, that had a lot of dedication and passion for the show um, and something that I think will live on in Emmerdale for a long, long time. Cast and crew, uh, however small your job or however big your job is there, thank you very much, every single person who has supported me. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Danny Miller from Thank you, gentlemen, and voted uh, to my beautiful girlfriend Kirsty, who's here tonight, who's shown ever, ever loving support. To Kate Oates, to everyone at Emmerdale, to the cast and crew of Emmerdale who've looked after me through thick and thin since 17. The opposite award for best dramatic performance. And the winner is Danny Miller from Thank the public uh, for everyone who voted. This is just uh, amazing.